Storytime by TCTS Ministries Condemned Soul Saved One evening when I was sitting at my desk doing a personal Bible study for prayer it was then strongly pressed upon my heart to say a special prayer for the entire prayer team. This prayer seemed to have been a prayer of urgency. Though I did not fully understand what God was up to that very moment, I knew that I needed to continue trusting Him despite the moments of my ignorance. Finally, it was time for prayer as other prayers then began calling into the line. We listened to a worship song before we began praying as usual, before then going straight into prayer. When the entire hour of prayer time had expired, the strangest thing then happened. After praying, we will always bid each other a goodbye before then hanging up. But that particular evening, instead of hanging up, we all just went straight into an hour and a half of Bible study, something we never did before after we were done praying. Before the end of the Bible study, the fiancé of a young woman on the line got on and began talking about his life to the point of tears, which was potentially a perfect opportunity for me to minister the gospel of Christ to him. So I asked him if he believed in the death and resurrection of Christ from the dead. Without any hesitation, he said he did and immediately wanted to invite Jesus the Christ into his heart as his Savior. Before I led him in prayer, I told him that it's not the words that saves a person, but it's the condition of the heart. He tearfully accepted before then asking the Lord to come into his heart as his Lord and Savior. God gets all the glory and praise for showing me his power and moving according to his will that evening.